All right, guys, I hope you're having an awesome Super Bowl, but there's a video that I just had to make about Nico Vado Avocado, okay? Nico has some major, major issues, okay? And we're gonna get into that on today's episode. First of all, the guy's gone nuts. As you can see, his last 20 videos, every thumbnail is like of him having a total mental breakdown, and I'll tell you exactly why that is happening. The man is dying. He is dying physically and mentally. Did he lose his boyfriend? Probably not. Did he, did he lose his job? Heck no. Did he get a new job? Absolutely not. Is he quitting YouTube? Heck no. He makes a heck of a lot of money. Two million subs, three to 400K views per video. That's three to $400 per video. The guy is not quitting, but here's what's happening and going on in his mind. And this is going to happen with almost any mook banger who does not do it or who does do it on a regular basis as often as he does every single day. They starve themselves every day to the point of having this massive pile of food in front of them for that thumbnail and then finishing what they can, right? But even if they don't finish all of it, it's still incredibly unhealthy, right? No matter what, even if you are going to the toilet and excreting all of it through the mouth or through the other end, it's still extremely unhealthy, right? Humans naturally desire few, uh, food that they can change into fuel and energy. None of the food I've seen him eat does that. It's either gluten or fried is what I've noticed. So in his head, mentally, he realizes, yes, I make a lot of money and that's why I keep doing this every day, but for how long can I sustain myself? He used to be a vegan. He knows the benefits of eating healthy. That's a fact. He knows that eating vegetables prepared in a tasty way equals fuel to the body, energy to the body, and also a thinner waistline. By no means do you need a thinner waistline if you're happy not having a thinner waistline. However, you can gain weight on things that are not fried or glutinous. Not saying he has to cut any of that out. But in his mind, I know for a fact that day in and day out, it would wane on somebody's mind and brain to realize that this food pile that is a daily thing will catch up to you eventually. If you don't mind being the weight that you are, that's great, more power to you. I don't care if you're fat or skinny. I have all kinds of friends. But what I do care about is your mental health. And Nico Vado Avocado, I don't believe is very happy. Or else, in my opinion, he wouldn't be going to the extreme to pump out what he's pumping out with the thumbnails that he's pumping out to the extreme that he's pumping it out if he didn't think there was a near end. That's my belief. That's my take on it. You let me know your thoughts down below. Once again, happy Super Bowl. I'm going to keep you up to date with all drama surrounding Nico Kato, Avocado. Thank you for watching.